Okay, while everyone's still excited about the Osmo 360, let's shift gears to something even bigger. DJI's next mini beast. Yep, I'm talking about the DJI Mini 5 Pro. And if the leaks are right, this thing's landing on August 7th. Now, that lines up perfectly with the recent FCC filings and DJI's usual launch routine. So don't be surprised if teaser videos start popping up any day now. But while we wait, let's break down what we think is coming um, and why it's kind of a big deal. So DJI is trying to pull off something wild here, a serious upgrade and still stay under that magic 250 grams weight limit. And honestly, that seems almost impossible with everything that's rumored. We're talking a bigger battery, LiDAR sensors, a better camera. How do you squeeze all that in without tipping the scale? If they actually pull it off, that's some wizard level engineering. Let's start with the camera, because this is where things get spicy. The Mini 5 Pro is expected to come with a 1 inch CMOS sensor. That's a big jump from the Mini 4 Pro's 1 over 1.3 inch sensor. For anyone who loves flying at sunset or in tricky lighting, this is going to be a huge win. Uh, bigger sensor equals more light, which equals better image quality. Uh, simple as that. And then there's LiDAR. Yep, LiDAR on a sub 250 grams drone. That's usually reserved for the big boys like the Mavic or Inspire series. Um, but if it's real, we're talking next level obstacle avoidance, especially in low light. Rumors also point to full-on omnidirectional sensing. We're talking sensors on the front, the back, and maybe even inward facing ones. Basically this thing might be covered in eyes, especially helpful if you're flying in tight spots. The design's also rumored to be totally new. No more slapping extra parts on the Mini 4 Pro body. This one's built from scratch to save every possible gram. Oh, and the gimbal? It's supposedly optimized for vertical shooting, perfect for your TikToks, Reels, or whatever app we're all obsessed with next month. Let's talk battery. A new 33.5 watt hour pack could mean flight times pushing 50 minutes. Now that's probably lab conditions with zero wind and no aggressive flying, but still, even getting close to that would be nuts. For reference, the Mini 4 Pro caps out at around 34 minutes with the standard battery, or 45 if you use the heavier plus one. So yeah, 50 minutes puts this thing in endurance territory, usually reserved for much bigger drones. Oh, and vented motors are part of the rumor mill too, supposedly more efficient, better cooling, and more power with less heat. Add in some improved propeller design and you're looking at one seriously dialed in drone. DJI is also expected to upgrade the transmission system to OcuSync 4 Plus, which could give you a wild 25 to 30 kilometers of video range, not that you should fly that far. But hey, the tech's there if you need it, and fast charging via USB-C PD up to 65 watt means less waiting between flights. Other neat extras, maybe onboard audio recording, upgraded active track 360 degree for smarter subject tracking, and a bump in internal storage, maybe even up to 16 gigs. Not massive, but perfect for emergency shots when you forget your SD card. Oh, and speaking of storage, rumors say this thing will handle up to 512 gigs of micro SD cards. So yeah, feel free to film everything in 4K until your heart's content. Price-wise, it's looking like somewhere between $850 and $950 for the base model. Not cheap, but honestly, if DJI delivers even half of what's rumored, it might be totally worth it. So yeah, the Mini 5 Pro might just be the drone that changes everything again. What's the one feature you're most excited about? The LiDAR, the camera, the extra flight time? Let me know down in the comments. This is gonna be fun to watch unfold. Catch you in the next one. Peace.